you can reuse model content that occurs frequently. In RS Express, fragments are applied for this purpose. Fragments are available for each model type. If you switch between models, the content of the fragments bar changes. You can create and use your own fragments, and you can delete fragments that are no longer needed. To create a new fragment, select the model items you want to use, right-click on them and click on Create Fragment in the pop-up menu. In the Fragments bar, fragments are displayed alphabetically. To have fragments displayed in a particular order, name them accordingly, or use a number before the name. The fragment appears in the first position in the Fragments bar. Branches are frequently used in business processes. You will now create a fragment for an XOR split. The name you have given the fragment puts it in second position. You can use the new fragments in the current and in other models. The fragments use previous object names. You can overwrite them. You can use descriptive object names and fragments to indicate how objects are used. When you later place a fragment, you know what its objects represent and how to name them. The brackets indicate that you must assign names to the fragment's objects once you place the fragment in the model. Now you can use the 3 XOR fragment to extend the model. If a fragment is no longer needed, you can simply right-click on it in the Fragments bar and delete it. After deletion, the fragment is no longer available for any model, but only the fragment is deleted. If you have used the fragment to place objects, these objects remain in the models. You have learned how to work with fragments when modeling.